Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are excited about today's videos because we will be looking at 10 side hustles that can pay more than your current job. But before we go on, please like, subscribe and share with your friends so they don't miss out on all the fun. Now let's jump right into the video. What are side hustles? A side hustle is a secondary job or business that someone pursues outside of their primary employment to earn extra income. It can range from freelancing, selling products online, offering services, consulting, or starting a small business. The idea is to utilize one's skills, interests, and available resources to generate additional income streams. A podcast is a series of spoken word, audio episodes focused on a particular topic or theme. Podcasts are distributed over the internet using a podcast hosting service, which stores all podcast episodes in one location. Podcasts can be audio or video content and are created by podcast creators who upload episodes for listeners to download. Now what are the things or items needed to start up your own podcast? Define your niche and target audience. Identify the topic and theme of your podcast and who you want to listen to it. Plan your content and format. Decide on the format of your podcast, the length of each episode, and what topics you will cover. Record and edit your episodes. Use your equipment to record your podcast, and then edit the audio to remove any background noise or mistakes. Choose a hosting platform. You'll need a place to host your podcast and distribute it to listeners. Popular options include Anchor, Buzzsprout, and SoundCloud. I would love to listen to your podcast. Selling photography can be a good side hustle for those who are passionate about photography and willing to put in the time and effort. There are several ways to monetize your photography, such as selling stock photos, offering personalized merch, or developing photo editing presets. Additionally, you can sell prints and digital copies of your photos on different platforms or your own website or blog. However, it is important to note that starting a photography side hustle requires dedication and hard work in order to be successful. To design and sell t-shirts online, there are several steps to take. First, it is important to find the perfect niche for your t-shirt designs. Then, you need to determine the product materials and printers that you will use. After that, create your t-shirt designs. Once you have done this, you can get started selling your t-shirts online. There are a variety of platforms available for selling custom t-shirts online, such as Shopify, BigCommerce, Printify, Bonefire, and Everpress. Each platform has its own advantages and disadvantages, so it is important to research each one before deciding which one is best for you. Additionally, it is important to consider factors such as cost of production and shipping when setting prices for your t-shirts. With the right strategy and platform, anyone can design and sell custom t-shirts online successfully. Dropshipping is a retail fulfillment method where a store doesn't keep the products it sells in stock. Instead, when a store sells a product, it purchases the item from a third-party supplier and has it shipped directly to the customer. The store doesn't handle the product itself. To start a dropshipping business, you will need a product niche. Research and choose a product category that you are passionate about and has potential for profitability. A supplier. Look for a reliable supplier who can provide the products you want to sell. Consider factors such as pricing, shipping times, and product quality. An online store. Set up an online store using a platform like Shopify or WooCommerce. Choose a domain name and design your store to reflect your brand. Marketing skills. Drive traffic to your store through social media, content marketing, and other methods. Order fulfillment process. Set up a system to process orders, purchase the product from your supplier, and have it shipped directly to your customer. Financial management. Keep track of your sales and expenses to identify areas for improvement and maximize your profits. Customer service. Provide excellent customer service to build a positive reputation and retain customers. Having a YouTube channel means creating and maintaining a presence on the video sharing platform, YouTube. This includes creating content such as videos, uploading and publishing them, promoting your channel and videos to grow your audience, engaging with your viewers through comments and other interactions, and potentially monetizing your channel through ads, sponsorships, or other means. It also involves managing the channel and keeping up with YouTube's community guidelines and policies. Yes, having a YouTube channel can be a great way to make money online. There are several ways to monetize a YouTube channel, including Google AdSense Running ads on your videos and earning a portion of the ad revenue Sponsorships and brand deals Working with companies to promote their products or services in your videos Merchandising Selling merchandise related to your brand or channel, such as t-shirts, mugs, etc. Premium content Offering exclusive paid content such as memberships, online courses, or ebooks However, it's important to note that making money on YouTube is not easy and requires a lot of hard work, creativity, and persistence. 
Building a large and engaged audience takes time and effort, and monetizing your channel effectively requires a good understanding of the platform, your audience, and the content that resonates with them. Being an online tutor means providing teaching or instructional services over the internet, usually through video conferencing platforms. As an online tutor, you can offer your expertise in a particular subject or skill, and help students learn through personalized lessons, assignments, and assessments. Online tutoring provides flexibility and convenience, as it can be done from anywhere with a reliable internet connection. To be an online tutor, you typically need to have a strong knowledge of the subject you want to teach and experience in teaching or mentoring others. You may also need to have equipment such as a computer, webcam, and microphone. There are many online tutoring platforms and websites where you can find students and offer your services, or you can start your own online tutoring business. Becoming an affiliate marketer involves promoting other people's or companies' products or services, and earning a commission for each sale made through your unique affiliate link. As an affiliate marketer, you can promote products through various channels such as a blog, website, social media, or email marketing. Becoming an affiliate marketer requires hard work, patience, and persistence, as well as a strong understanding of the products you are promoting, and the target audience you are trying to reach. It's also important to comply with the rules and regulations set by the affiliate programs, and avoid engaging in deceptive or unethical practices. Renting your home to vacationers means allowing travelers to temporarily stay in your property while on vacation. This can be done through online platforms such as Airbnb, VRBO, or Booking.com, which connect homeowners with travelers looking for short-term rental accommodations. To rent your home to vacationers. Renting your home to vacationers can be a great way to earn extra income, but it also comes with responsibilities and potential risks, such as property damage, theft, or liability issues. It's important to be aware of the laws and regulations regarding short-term rentals in your area, and to have insurance coverage to protect your property and personal assets. Delivering groceries refers to the process of transporting food and household items from a grocery store or warehouse to a customer's location. This can be done by a delivery service, such as a truck or bike carrier, or by the customer picking up the items themselves. The rise of online grocery shopping and home delivery has made this process more convenient for many people, as they can order items from the comfort of their own home. It can be a way to make money, yes. Delivery jobs, whether for groceries or other items, offer a flexible schedule and the ability to work independently. Some companies may offer part-time or full-time positions with benefits, while others may offer gig-style work for independent contractors. However, as with any job or business, the amount of money that can be earned depends on many factors, such as the local demand for delivery services, the cost of operating a delivery vehicle, and competition from other delivery providers. Additionally, some expenses, such as fuel, vehicle maintenance, and insurance, must be taken into account. Creating and selling handmade goods can be a great way to make money as a side hustle. This type of work allows for creativity, independence, and the opportunity to turn a hobby into a profitable business. There are many platforms, such as Etsy, where you can sell your handmade goods online and reach a large customer base. You can also sell your items at local markets, craft fairs, and through social media. The key to success in this type of business is to create high-quality, unique products that people are willing to pay for, and to market those products effectively to your target audience. However, like any business, there is no guarantee of success, and it may take time and effort to establish a customer base and build a profitable operation. There you have it friends, those are the 10 side hustles that can pay more than your current job. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.